They say you're a pilgrim. Haven't you found your place yet? They say you're a pilgrim. Haven't you found your place yet? Were you a pilgrim? I know, a female pilgrim. There weren't many of us. But that's why I was so good at it. No one would recognize me as a pilgrim. Some men thought that as a woman, it would be easier to deceive me. Rob me. My fast reflexes and sharp dagger taught them otherwise. How'd you end up in Villador? I got this goddamn job. A guy wanted me to deliver a package to Villador. To some woman who was well known before the outbreak. Apparently she played video games professionally. Weird job, eh? Anyway, the guy paid me a lot, but on one condition. I couldn't know what was in the package. And that was my big mistake. I carried this damn thing for 50 kilometers, and with each step it got heavier. I sneaked into Villador, found this woman, and delivered the package. She opened it in front of me. Turned out, it was a jar, with a human head inside. Whose head? I don't really know. I got the fuck out of there right quick. Is that why you quit the life? Well, I felt that, actually, that I was constantly running away from something. Maybe from myself. This is a big city. Even a pilgrim can belong here. Nobody judges you for what you were before, like they do in the smaller towns. Who you used to be beyond the walls. What you once did. They kept you on the move. You can disappear in the city. That's how I found my place. And what about you, Aiden? Don't you want to stop running? I don't know what it means to belong. I understand. Just remember this. You can't run away from yourself. Good luck, Pilgrim. Yeah, maybe someday. But first, I have to finish what I started here. I understand. Just remember this. You can't run away from yourself. Good luck, Pilgrim. <laughs>